Hello. Hello. So nice and lovely. Ah, 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 ah. Okay. <sighs> okay, welcome to another update video of Terra Frutis. What I'm doing right now is clearing and mulching the uh, Anonas. We're calling it Anona Dum. It's just a space that we're planting lots of Anonas, which is the family of uh, Soursop, Rolinia, um, Adamoya, Cherimoya. Custard apple. Um, what's the other one? Some nothing else apple. Other apples. These sweet fruits. They, they can fruit pretty quick in under five years just from seed. Um, they're pretty good for a wet climate. And in this area, we've got Adamoyas, sugar apples, custard apple. Um, yeah, maybe Bullock's Heart and uh, Purple Custard Apple, or Purple Sugar Apple. But yeah, this is one of them. I've actually, I mean, I don't know. It's my fault, but yeah, I lost track of which ones are which, so I don't really know anymore which ones are which, but we'll know once they fruit. So here's one of them. As you can see, it was uh, mulched. I've already mulched everything around here. These are uh, ten plants or so. So I'm just going to show you how they're doing and then we can look at them in an update video and you can see how much they've grown or how much they've died. So there's the first one right over there. Um, I'll show you that one last. This is the second one. This is the third one. I, I believe this is an Adamoya, which is probably one of the best ones, but of course it's doing, it's like one of the worst ones right now. But. It's all right, it's got lots of leaves on it. It's coming back. I just mulched it, cleared out all the weeds around there underneath the mulch. Like first I removed the sticks, machete everything, and then I pull all the weeds that are close to it, and then I grab everything I can for mulch and to smother the future weeds from coming up and the other ones from creeping in. Here's another one, use some big leaves here. Here's a nice one. It's getting a little sunburned. That means we put it out here too young, but it's coming back and it's gonna, you know, give it time. It's a nice thing about these big trees. As long as we keep them alive, they'll pick it up and they'll they'll take over soon. And this one back here. What is this? One, two, three, four. Four fifth tree. This one's really, seems like nothing, but it's still alive. It's that right there behind my machete. It's just a twig, so there's nothing to look at there really. But we'll see if it comes back. That's the nice thing about doing these videos. Right now you're just watching them and you'll see what's going on, but if you're watching these in a five years, 10 years, we'll probably do some collections and speed up the time. And it's the magic of television. And there's a little one. This one's pretty big. Not sure what that one is. Might be a Sonkoya. Which I recently had in Costa Rica and I'm actually pretty fond of them. Fibrous, but the fibers break easily in your mouth. This one must be like a custard apple or sugar apple, I guess. So there's only four on this side, so in total there's nine. But we're gonna keep planting once we get more available. And over here is a couple of Namwa bananas. This one's doing well. And this one's looks sad. 
And back to the first one, which looks pretty happy. Yep. So that's a Nona Dome. Right next to Papaya Dome.